I have seen that many Amazon seller got confused about the barcodes of Amazon. Like what is FNSKU, what is UPC, what is ASIN and what is the barcode that they have to actually paste on their product packaging. So they can just ship out the inventory to the Amazon FBA warehouse and Amazon then can scan their barcodes and ship their product to their customer when they get an order. So indeed it is an important thing but on the other hand it's a very simple task that most people get confused about. So in this short video I'm going to be just showing you quickly in one minute that how you can generate the FNSKU label for your product. So you can paste those FNSKU label on your product packaging or you can just send those labels to your supplier so they can paste on your behalf on your product packaging and then they can ship the product to the Amazon FBA warehouse and you can just sit back and relax. So FNSKU is the code that you need to paste. You don't need to paste any UPC code, you don't need to paste any EN code or any other type of code. So the FNSKU code you can generate from your seller central. So let's see how we can do this. But before getting started, I'm Uzair and I sell my products on Amazon, eBay, Shopify, ClickFunnel and Redbubble. And on this channel, I share my knowledge with you people so you can do the same and build your online business. So if you are interested in learning about the fastest and easiest way to make money online, which can give you profit in your first 7 days, then make sure to sign up for my free 30 minutes webinar from the link below so you can also achieve financial freedom like me and leave your 9 to 5 job. So without any further delay, let's start the video. Alright, so as you can see here on my computer screen, I have just typed FNSKU on Google and you can see that I am having a list of barcode. So you can see that this image is showing clearly the difference between UPC number and FNSKU number. So you can see that FNSKU will look something like this. So if you go to the supermarket, pick up any product like any tomato ketchup or any eatable product and you just go to the counter, so the counter person will scan that product. So that product will be added to your cart. So that will be a universal product code, UPC code, which will be stick on every branded product. But if you are selling your private label product on Amazon, then you no need to pay the UPC code on your product packaging. If it's already there, then it's good. But if it's not there, then you need to pay the FNSKU code. So if I go up, I click on printer. So you can see that. So you can see that this is the example of an FNSKU code on the product packaging. So. To generate the FNSKU code from your Amazon Seller Central, you need to go to your Seller Central, you need to click on Inventory, Manage Inventory, and from there, you need to navigate to that product listing on which you need to paste the FNSKU code and send it to Amazon Warehouse. So, for example, I click on this variation, and I want to send this variation of this product to Amazon FBA Warehouse. So, if I need to print two FNSKU labels, one for this variation and other for this variation, so I have to check both of these, and after checking the boxes, I need to click on Action. And when I click on action, I can see the drop down menu and from this drop down menu, I have to click on print item labels. And then you need to click on yes continue. And after that, you need to put the quantity of each variation you want to send. For example, I want to send uh, 5 units of this and 7 units of this. So it will be a total 12 units. And after putting the number of units, I have to click on print item labels and click on OK. And you can see the PDF file has already been downloaded on my PC. And when I click on this PDF file, so you can see that I am having 12 barcodes here. These are the FNSKU barcodes. So you have to simply print out them and you have to simply cut them and paste them in the boxes. So you can see that these barcodes are having 5 different ASIN and 7 different ASINs because we have put the quantity of 5 for one variation and 7 for other variation. So I hope this short video helps you a lot in understanding the concept of barcodes and now you can just easily and confidently print the FNSKU barcode for your Amazon product and just ship them to the FBA warehouse very easy way. So if you like this short video then make sure to subscribe my channel because I keep uploading these kind of videos for you that will help you to solve your e-commerce problem and help you to make more money online. And if you want to ask any question from me regarding any e-commerce business then you can just write down your question in the comment box below or you can just book a free consultation call with me from the link in the description below. So let's meet in the next video till then take care bye.